going through with the same logic as before. Our vertex is back 1, 2, 3, 4, and down 1, 2, 3. Negative 4, negative 3. Hard to see. Negative 4, negative 3. Easier to see. Inside our absolute value, we're going to change the sign of the x value. Call it x plus 4. And then a minus 3. The open and wide um, thing here, if we go up 1 over 1, 2, 3, 4, it's up 1 over 4. 1 over 4, it's a positive because it's upright. And when we go back over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, it's 8, comma 0. Don't! It's not. That's a dirty lie. At least I fessed up. It's 0, comma 8. Get it right. Okay? I'm going to do this because I can, and because I think it's a good idea. X minus 0. You don't have to do that. But it does remind us that we are saying minus whatever that value is. Which means we're changing the sign. We can't change it to sign of 0 to just say x minus 0. If you just put x, you'd be fine. Plus 8. The slope is, is down 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and over 1. So it's a negative 5. Um, it's negative because the, the v is upside down. 